Hi everyone, I am Zianda Kumalo aka Black Rose. I am a poet, I am a writer, I'm an inspirational speaker and I am an entrepreneur and I have procrastinated this YouTube channel for so flippin' long and I finally decided that this is it, we're doing it. Probably because of the whole self quarantine, I have more time and I'm able now to give this side of myself to people. So the topic for this first video is going to be giving yourself a chance. So with me personally, I have procrastinated this YouTube channel for three, four years. And I've procrastinated half of the things I'm finally deciding to do now and I'm finally doing now. I've procrastinated finally publishing my own book. I've procrastinated finally being who I am meant to be. I have procrastinated finally getting my poetry out there. I have procrastinated so many things. But that aligns with my fear because for me, my fear is my biggest fear is failure so with everything that i do the first thing that comes to mind is what if what if i fail what if it doesn't go as i expected what if and that has been my my biggest flaw and i embrace it now because as much as i still think of those what ifs now i don't just think of failure i think of victory as well so i just wanted to put this video out and let you guys know that it's it's time you you put yourself first it's time you give yourself a chance and what i mean by this is so many times we we say we want to do certain things we say we want to meet certain people but we all give them a time limit so in five years i want to meet this person in two years i want to travel to in 10 years i want to be why then why not now and I feel as though so many times we question ourselves and we don't support ourselves like other people would. I mean, the, the thing that people are always saying is you need to love yourself before you need to love someone else. So in this way, you need to put yourself first before you're able to put other people before you. And what happens is, and I'm, I'm a testimony of this. I've always put people in front of me. I've always put situations in front of me because I've been too scared to look within myself. I've been too scared to put myself first and say, hey, look, sis, you, you, you need help, sis. You need, you need comfort. You need love. You need healing. And finally, I'm coming into a space where I'm open to doing that. And probably because 2019 hit me really hard it hit me so hard that i didn't know where i'm going i didn't know what i want to do and i just prayed and i said you know what lord it's 2020 and i'm praying that good things come out of it i'm praying that things change i'm praying that i learn to love myself i'm praying i learn to care about myself i'm praying that i learn to put myself first i'm praying i learn to give myself a chance and that prayer has carried me so far since 2020 because so many things have been happening since I told myself and I prayed to God and I said, I need to put myself first. I need to give myself a chance. And that chance is finally here. That chance has been availing itself in everything that I do. But that's because I decided to put myself first. I decided to give myself that chance. So basically, all in all, what I want you guys to know is that it's okay. It's okay to hurt and it's okay to hurt so much that you don't want to realize that pain. You don't want to go into that pain. It's okay to break here and there. It's okay to cry. It's okay to laugh so hard because you don't want to cry. It's okay to break in the midst of people and not know what to do. It is okay. It is perfectly okay. 
that's in an essence you getting into yourself and don't block that from happening because once you do you lose an essence of yourself because you're you're not giving yourself the time to open up to yourself and i'd like to share a poem with you guys that i wrote on this topic priority i hope your wounds begin to heal I hope your defeats stand as victory. I hope your fears become wishing wells. I hope you're choosing yourself. Some days you may feel like you're trying too hard. Other days it's as if it's not enough. You probably haven't really smiled in a while with your eyes and your soul showing gratitude to your joy. Did you pour yourself something to drink while your favorite meal is cooking on the stove, hoping you're Netflixing with the facial you save for special occasions. The extra flavored popcorn with the bubble bath running with the bath bomb you bought a while ago. I hope you're loving on yourself. So when you get up tomorrow, I hope you're ready to take that step, to take that step into yourself, to take a bet on yourself. May you be ready to see yourself in a different light, out of mind and out of sight. So I hope you deem yourself important. I hope you deem yourself a priority. And that's that from me. I am so excited to start this journey. I am hoping that I do get support. I am hoping that this made you think a bit on how you need to start realizing the things you do with yourself and how you treat yourself and who you are with yourself and i'm hoping it did make a change in someone's life today and i would like you guys to please like please share please comment down below please subscribe to this channel it is new it is popping and i will be posting a video every week just to inspire you guys, just to keep you guys going, just to make you guys realize that we are human. We are all human and we will get there. We will get to where we have always dreamed to be. We will get there. Yeah, and that's it from me. Please follow me on all my other social media networks. I am Zianda Kumalo, aka Black Rose, signing out. Love you.